Tommy, a small turnaround and another away trip on Tuesday night, our first midweek game of the season. What are the thoughts ahead of that one? Well, we're looking forward to it, obviously, with the, the result we got on Saturday. We, we want to bounce back as quickly as we can. You can only do that when the next match comes along. So with it being within a couple of days, there's the positives and the negatives of that. Obviously, we've had a long trip. Um, they haven't. We've not had a great result, but then neither did they. So both teams will want the game. Um, and looking at the way they play, the way we play, I think it'll be an entertaining fixture. Obviously, Eversley came up to the, to the National League this season, but they did do so well in the, in the division below last year. So there's going to be a tough challenge, aren't they? Yeah, I mean, they're another team, a little bit like Oxford City in, in terms of the, they used to win football matches. So to have lost on uh, Saturday in their own patch, they're going to be a wounded animal, a bit like Oldham were at the weekend. So we're, we're very mindful of what they do. They're a very, very, very good technical side. Um, and I don't think they're going to change a, a, a massive amount from even though they've been promoted. So they stick with their beliefs. And like I said, I think it'll be an entertaining game. Um, there's going to be ups and downs all the way through the campaign. And I'm as calm today as I was last Monday when you asked me after we'd won a game 5-2, as we did when we lost the game 5-1. So looking back at the game on Saturday, I just feel some big big decisions went against us at, at crucial times in the game. And if Sputs and maybe he's never win your football matches, goals do. And we didn't score enough goals on Saturday. It's as simple as that. In terms of the squad, obviously in training earlier, we saw Hadi was out there with the lads again. That's, that's obviously a bonus and, and adds to the to the strike force, which because Kwame will be missing now. When he's at... Kwame missed the game through suspension again. Like I said, big decisions went against us in that game. Um, them two being being two of the major ones. Um, but you know, somebody not being available just opens the door for somebody else. So actually, we had every player on the pitch available to us apart from Kwame, uh, this morning in training. So it's, it's a full squad in terms of that. Um, there'll be a lot of lads who are sitting there now because the, the reverse happened to last weekend and we'll expect an opportunity and then they will get it. So, you know, it's a squad game. It's, you know, we've said it before. And we've had six great weeks of pre-season. We had a really good opening fixture. We had a really big punch in the nose against all of them. And fair play to them, they, they took their, their chances and we've got, to, we've got to get ourselves up off the canvas and go again because it's relentless, it's 46 games, but we were working out this morning, it could be equivalent to 53 games with the amount of extra time that we're playing, so everybody will get an opportunity and I'm sure whichever 11 we start and whichever 11 finish the game, they'll be giving everything for the badge on the front. And, you know, you look at Saturday and it wasn't the best result we had, but obviously when we had a good result on the first game of the season, it's just about replicating that maybe again, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, there were a lot of things we did replicate on Saturday, we just didn't put the ball in the goal often enough for the for the attempts that we went into the box or the, the shots that we had at their goal. And we didn't defend well enough, let's be honest, to a man, it isn't not just the back line, we, didn't, we weren't strong enough in, in our duels all across the pitch in the first half, and I think that's where we let ourselves down. So the players know exactly what we feel as a staff, um, and we as a staff, have a job to pick them up and to, to get them going again. And I think, as you, you've seen yourself, training's been really bright and buzzy this morning. We, like I said, we've had to take into account how much load we put on this morning because we've had a long up and down the country. So at least actually it's only just around the corner. Um, so we'll be going around the corner, around the M25 tomorrow, look, looking to try and put things right.